eh kazi ziko hapa Saudi Arabia niliacha tu nikiwaonyesha Saudi Arabia kuna kazi mingi sana za almarai kwanza almarai inakuanga kampuni kubwa sana haya kampuni ingine inakuanga ya kuku kampuni ingine inakuanga ya yani kuna a lot of opportunities huku kuna maoteli mingi sana wanataka drivers wa deliver chakula wanataka cleaners wa ku clean hoteli wanataka chef wa kupika chakula wanataka steward wa kuosha vyombo haya kuna ma supermarket mingi sana wanataka cashiers wanataka supermarket attendants wanataka watu wa kuchunga yours nini supermarket that is security so huko Saudi Arabia kuna kazi nyingi sana za ma drivers eh? kazi bodi za... Hi guys welcome back to the Ivano TV guys today I'm your host Okay guys by the way welcome ni chapo tunakula leo mnaziona Yes ni chapo tunakula leo na kanaeske hapa. So, uh, kuna video nyingine hapa tulifanya, tuli, tulikuwa studio, tulikuwa watu wanne, tulikuwa online Gulf Media na hiyo video ilikuwa about uh, Saudi Arabia hakuna visa. So guys, uh, ni kama some of you wali wali to misquote, yani wali to misunderstand na hiyo interview. Okay, I'm just here to clear the hair. Uh, hakuna mtu hata ukienda usikize kwa hiyo video tulisema kwa Saudi Arabia kuna a lot of jobs a lot of job opportunities na Saudi Arabia haijawahi kosa kazi Saudi Arabia ndio kubwa sana kati uh, of all uh, Gulf countries so i'm just here to clear the hair hakuna mtu alisema Saudi hakuna kazi tulisema visa ndio zimekuwa less visa ndio zinakosa So unajua mimi nilipata messages mingi kwa inbox mara kuna wenye wanataka ni wa connect wakiwa Saudi Arabia wataki kwenda Kenya kwa sababu wengine wako na 48 years kuna mwingine aliniambia ako na 52 we So kuna wenye hawataki kwenda nyumbani wananiambia ni wa connect wakiwa tu hapa Saudi Arabia of which sijui kama hiyo inaweza work again kuna mwenye aliniuliza na kama nimelipiwa uh, ticket ya kwenda na kurudi kama umelipiwa ticket ya kwenda na kurudi hiyo haina shida si unaenda vacation alafu urudi si already we uko na visa yani guys uh, uki sasa iko hivi visa ndio aziko na visa ni za ex saudi ndio aziko which means mtu mwenye amemaliza contract akienda Kenya that is kama arudi Kenya Saudi Arabia kata, kama arudi ke, tena Saudi Arabia maybe uh, inaweza take long kitambo apate visa atapata visa lakini atakaa for long bila kupata visa kwa sababu sijui ni Saudi Arabia ama ni agent wamepanga hii deal wanasema wanataka watu fresh fresh hawataki mtu mwenye ako na experience ya Saudi Arabia na ukiangalia Dubai Qatar hakuna kazi hata Kuwait hakuna kazi so mali kuna kazi tu ni maybe Saudi Arabia Lebanon na Bahrain na ukiangalia Bahrain na Lebanon kamshahara ni kadogo sana na bado Lebanon ni kanchi kingine kana kuanga kama skini sana na kako na mateso sana hmm? so kwa nini muli ni wapi mu, kwenye mkuelewa by the way ulizeni maswali ask me any question any irritative question that you have at the comment section i will answer you hata kama sita kuanza mtu atakuja akuanse eh kazi ziko hapa Saudi Arabia niliacha tu nikiwaonyesha Saudi Arabia kuna kazi mingi sana za almarai kwanza almarai inakuanga kampuni kubwa sana haya kampuni ingine inakuanga ya kuku kampuni ingine inakuanga ya 
yani kuna a lot of opportunities huku kuna maoteli mingi sana wanataka drivers wa kudeliver chakula wanataka cleaners wa ku clean hoteli wanataka chef wa kupika chakula wanataka steward wa kuosha vyombo aya kuna ma supermarket mingi sana wanataka cashiers wanataka supermarket attendants wanataka watu wa kuchunga yours nini supermarket that is security so huku Saudi Arabia kuna kazi nyingi sana za ma drivers eh? kazi bodi za madem na machali kazi ziko mingi mingi za nyumba sana zenye hata mwezi maliza kwa hivyo sisi hatu kusema ati hakuna uh, kazi tulisema visa ndio zimekosekana na hatujui ni saidi ya maagent wameungana ama ni serikali ya Kenya ama ni wa, ama ni wa Saudi wenyewe so mimi nilikuwa na hayo na maybe mtu akani kuna mtu alikuwa ananiuliza the cheapest dege kuna mtu alikuwa na amelipiwa amemaliza one year so alikuwa ananiambia boss wake amemwambia mwezi wa saba watoto wakifunga shule yeye ataenda vacation two year two months alafu arudi tena by the time anarudi watoto watakuwa wamemaliza shule so madam wake akanipigia simu akaniuliza so mimi ile dege yenye cheapest ina kuanga ni uh, by the way kuna kuanga na Saudi Airlines Air Arabia Air Arabia ni mkokote nyingine ni mkokote nyingine ina kuanga very cheap i think ni 800 hata Saudi Airlines ni 800 850 real sama 800 aya kuna Flyer Del kuna Qatar Airways ziko mingi ziko mingi sana lakini ile dege cheapest lakini bado ujue dege itategemea unataka ya direct ama unataka yenye inaenda destination inasimama inaenda tena inasimama like for me uh, napendanga sana mm, mi naendanga na Saudi Airlines hata boss wangu akienda outside uh, Saudi wanatumianga Saudi Airlines lakini ile cheapest ni ya Arabia yani hiyo ni kama mkokoteni ni kama wheelbarrow eh? lakini that is, si bora ufike Kenya mimi hata nasemanga hata ni, wanipeleke tu na mkokoteni bora nifike Kenya hata kama ni baiskeli bora nifike Kenya sio lazima ni kule kwa dege sio lazima nikae starehe hapana mimi nitaenda tu nitafika alafu nitarudi tena aya tu, tuliongea mambo mingi sana tukaongea about exit visa exit stamp unaona So ni vizuri sana kuambia boss wako wewe kama unarudi unarudi kama urudi akupe exit usitoke kwa hiyo nyumba kama hajakupea exit wengine wanajifanyanga wajinga tu by the time unataka kurudi Saudi Arabia unapata oh my god mpaka five years ziishe ndio nirudi Saudi Arabia Jesus kwa nini kwa sababu hukupewa exit hmm? anyway guys hmm, naomba mniulize maswali Uniulize maswali na muache kumisquat. Muache kumisunderstand and then you start spreading fake news all over. Eh? Fake news all over. So, Saudi ni Saudi yani Saudi ni country nzuri sana. Ni vile tu Kenya wetu wakikuja hapa wengine wanakufa kiholela holela wanakufa kama kuku. Sijawahi si jua ni kwa nini vifo hapa Saudi Arabia zinakuanga mingi hivyo compared to other national gulf uh, countries like kuwait lebanon bahrain you know i don't get it guys not unless you you tell me the reason the causes of death ai wa kenya wetu wanakufianga hapa saudi arabia sana 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 sio makemboi sio wa contract sio nini na hapa saudi bado ndio kuna mateso lakini Saudi Arabia kuna kuanga na salari mzuri. Kwanza ukipata boss mzuri, unaweza fanya kwa hiyo nyumba hata miaka kumi. By the time unarudi Kenya, unapata uko na maploti zako. Uko na mashamba yako. Umeinvest yani very smart. Eh? You know in this planet earth guys, let me tell you something. Eh? We we just fanya kila kitu uki risk. Feel free to risk. Everything is about to risk. We risk by learning. Nunua hmm? shamba. Wewe anzisha kamjei pale. Mi naambianga my fellow ladies as long as uko golf, eh? Unajisikia ni kama unaweza jenga karumka moja kasingo. 
jenga wachana na na huyo fala unamuita bwanangu my boyfriend wachana na yeye kabisa as long as you are in a position to pay a school fees for your kids remember unaposomesha watoto wako ni kama ku invest you are investing in your kids by the time wanamaliza shule those people those kids they will help you they will never forget about their mother eh? so guys If if at all you are in a position so mesha watoto jenga kanyumba kamoja pale uko unajipiga kifua nuno hata shamba pale matuzi na uzo 120 100 150 matu kuna shamba raisi i myself nimenunua matu hmm. nimenunua shamba mingi sana matu na make sure ni genuine kwanza fanya utafiti afadhali utafute lawyer umulipe akufanye uchunguzi yeah? nunua shamba Jenga tu karumuka moja jipigange kifua unasemanga nilipokuwa Saudi Arabia mimi nilinunua shamba nikajenga ambia watu umejenga the bedroom lakini ni kasingo eh sini yako jipiga ah my fellow ladies msini yangu shange don't don't tengemea this idiot ah ah bwanako sahii yako Kenya Aujui yako wapi? Aujui alilala na nani usiku? Wacha kujipea stress juu ya mwanaume manzi. Tafuta pesa wanaume watakuja polepole. Pole. The right person atakuja atakupea heshima sana manzi. Ah, msini yangu shange my fellow ladies, mimi nataka tuwe tuwe a master of of your own destiny. Be a master of your own destiny. Be a, a boss lady, eh? Kitu ya kwanza usinunue gari kama hujanunua shamba. But anyway inategemeanga juu kuna mtu atasema ah mimi siwezi lala kwa shamba lakini naweza lala kwa gari. Lakini nataka kuwaibia siri. Kununua shamba nataka kuwapea just a small example between kununua shamba na kununua gari. Yes utanunua gari maybe itaingia kwa biashara. Okay utanunua shamba hiyo shamba itakaa hapo. Maybe umenunua shamba ya 500. Ukinunua shamba ya 500 in 5 years to come hiyo shamba unaweza uza hata 2 million mashamba kila siku zina appreciate appreciate <coughs> mashamba zinapanda kila siku kila siku mashamba zinapanda so guys wakati ambao unanunua gari gari utakuwa unatoa kwa mfuko Uta, una, unatoa pesa kwa mfuko unaweka mafuta unapeleka gari garage yani gari itakukula lakini shamba itaenda kila siku mal, mchanga kila siku inapanda inapanda you guys if at all kuna watu wanasemanga pesa ya gulf aisaidi yangi na mimi nawapeanga advice tu moja ukikuja Saudi Arabia ama gulf countries jipe 5 good months piga simu nyumbani mwezi wa kwanza waambie simu yako imeharibika that is kama una watoto maybe uko na mtoto mmoja Si ukiwa Kenya bado huyo mtoto alikuwa anakula. Yaani umekuja hapa Gulf wewe ndio umekuwa utanunua chakula, ufanye shopping, ulipe chama, siju ufanye nini, eh? Jifanye mjinga. Jipe tuseme hata yes, five months. Jifanya simu imeharibika. Tuseme unalipwa 30k thousand. Si ni five months tu. 30 times 5 that is 150. Tafuta shamba mahali popote lakini utafute eh, lawyer kwanza kama ujui kama hiyo shamba ni genuine tafuta lawyer kwanza hizo five months nunua shamba my friend utakuwa unatoka Saudi Arabia unasema ah Saudi Arabia imenisaidia sana by the way guys acha niniwaambie kuna mtu ukimtajia Saudi Arabia anaweza jinyonga na kuna mwingine ukimwambia Saudi Arabia ni kubaya mtakosana kabisa sisi wote tulipata boss tofauti tulipata boss wengine wabaya wengine wanakutesa ni watu wangapi wamerudi Kenya wakiwa kwa wilcha from Saudi Arabia mpaka mnakumbuka Mary mpaka saa hii hajawahi pona kwanza ali paralyze kabisa mnakumbuka Anita Anita amepona lakini alirudi akiwa kwa wilcha Yaani watu wanakuja hapa na matumaini lakini vitu zina backfire. Kama ulipata boss mzuri, thank God. Jifunzeni kushukuru Mungu, fanya thanksgiving manzi. Haikukua rahisi. Saudi Arabia sio kuraisi. Eh? So guys, 
namalizia hapo kama kuna mali nimekosea naomba mnisamehe na guys please i beg you to subscribe to my channel you can share with your friends kama unaona kama hii kitu itamsaidia yeah and i wish you all the best may your prayers be answered in jesus name may what you have been praying for be answered manzi may your dreams come true bye for now see you in the next video guys